Welcome to Equalizers with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn how to take backup of a single table from a database on MySQL server by using MySQL dump. This is a very common scenario when uh, we are working as a DBLS, say we want to insert, delete, or update some uh, records on a table. But before we do that, we would like to take the backup of that, uh, that table. Uh, now, let's go ahead and perform this. Uh, this is uh, really easy. So, here is the uh, the syntax you are going to use, you are going to say MySQL dump, then you are going to say dash dash user, provide username, so and then you will say dash dash password, provide your password, and here you will say log tables or whatever the other option you would like to use with the MySQL dump. I will say go ahead and study these all different switches with the MySQL dump so you can make better choices when you are taking the backup for your different tables or databases. Here you will provide the database name and then you will provide the table name. Then you will say greater than and provide the directory path where you would like to take the backup and the name of the backup file. Okay, so we, let's uh, modify this uh, script a little bit uh, according to our uh, need and perform a demo. Here, what I have, uh, I already have a username and password written for one of the uh, right here. So I'm just going to copy and paste the whole uh, username and password part of it. So just paste it there. So uh, I am going to use backup user here and uh, this is my password for backup user and the database name I'm using uh, tech brothers uh, IT new. So if you will uh, say it, uh, right here uh, tech brothers T C H P or brother IT new. That's the name of the database I would like to use and the table uh, is uh, going to be employee. Okay, where I would like to write the data, I would like to write the data on root directory MySQL backup um, directory and the name of the file I would like to say employee table. Okay, employee table and I would always uh, recommend to put uh, some date time with it. Let's say 11 26 uh, uh, 2018 is the date today, so we'll go ahead and put that one. Okay, so copy this statement. Uh, no, now you are all good, and we will run on the shell. So let's connect to your uh, uh, Linux box, uh, and here I am connected already with my my, my Linux box, uh, and uh, where we have installed our um, MySQL server. Okay, I'm going to paste the query by right clicking here, and then it should create uh, this file. It is uh, saying, "Hey, you know what, MySQL." Uh, uh, backup directory does not exist because I made a mistake here mysql d so that does not exist it is mysql backup simple so I will go back and fix that one mysql copy the statement again so let's go ahead and copy the whole line run it uh, on the shell Okay, it is saying, uh, saying uh, tech unknown database. Uh, so see, I'm making a small mistakes here. Uh, what is that? Uh, tech Brothers. Uh, okay, I am missing I in the name of that. Tech Brothers uh, IT. Okay, instead of saying Tech Brother. Uh, okay, take this uh, the command one more time and uh, run it. Now it should run. Yeah, it completed successfully. Now, if we go back to the MySQL backup directory, so I'm uh, I'm going to say cd, go to the MySQL ls minus la, so it should show me this uh, backup. So you can see right here. So my employee underscore table, and and then we have date eleven twenty six uh, twenty eighteen dot sql. If I would like to see the size of this file, I can always say uh, du minus ach, and that will show me the size of this file. Okay, right there. So 5.2 MB. That's the size. Uh, if I would like to see what's in this uh, file, I can uh, you know, easily uh, use the cat command here. So say cat and uh, then just paste it. Uh, and you will see all uh, the data with the definition of tables uh, or whatever you have. Uh, you will you will be able to see that. Uh, you can also uh, find uh, some strings or whatever you need to from here by, by using different uh, uh, commands on the Linux. Uh, thanks very much for watching this video and I hope uh, this video will help.